The last few months have been really intense and I haven't had much time off. I really needed to have a day for cleaning, running some errands and for meeting up with a friend. So here's the day in my life. I got up early as usual. It's pitch black outside this time of year. I pulled up my blinds and cracked open the window to air my bedroom out. On my way into the kitchen to feed Minnie and Bonus, I turned on the lights, one by one. Then I spent some time at the beach, aka the litter box. I'm always wading through sand in the morning. Then I went off for my walk. My ice scrapers are on this time of year. It's not icy all the time everywhere, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. This was an icy morning though, so I was happy they were on. My walk takes about an hour around the lake, and while I walk I listen to an audiobook. After I got back home, I got ready. And that brings me to the sponsor of this video, Function of Beauty. Ever since I tried Function of Beauty's hair care last summer, it's all I've used. I love how personalized the products are. You select your hair goals, choose the color and fragrance, and you even get to put your name on the bottles. My hair is very fine, so my hair goals are to volumize, strengthen and replenish. Volumize being the main goal right now. I went for no color, and this time I chose the eucalyptus and mint fragrance. It leaves my hair and my bathroom smelling so fresh after I washed my hair. Aside from shampoo and conditioner, I still swear by the serum for taming the flyaways and keeping my pixie smooth. Function of Beauty only uses clean ingredients, so no parabens, sulfates, GMOs or toxins. And it's all 100% vegan and cruelty free. They're also dermatologist tested, so I know they won't irritate my scalp. I have the smaller size, but you can now get even bigger bottles for 20% off. If you want to try these personalized hair care products and get 20% off your first set, click the link in the description. My cat bonus likes to join me at night and I noticed some paw prints on my pillowcase, so I decided to change the sheets on my bed. After airing the pillows and duvet outside for a while, I put on fresh sheets. I love a clean bed. I also picked up a couple of things that were not in the proper places.
We don't get a lot of sun this time of year, but when we do get a lighter day, all the dirt becomes very apparent, so I did a little cleaning in the kitchen. The area where I feed my cat gets cleaned quite often. They get fresh bowls in the morning, so here I just remove the mat, cleaned around it and put a fresh one down, before putting everything back again. I did notice the dust bunnies flying around, so I got my Dyson out. Bonus is nowhere to be seen when I vacuum, but Minnie doesn't really care much. Then I had a quick snack in the form of an egg with Kalis caviar. I've been growing some cat grass and it was ready. I also took the opportunity to clean around the cat flap. Then I got some work done. This is pretty much where I've spent all my time lately. It's been a lot. I really enjoyed it, but I'm excited for things to calm down a bit in the next few months. I haven't really had a chance to go downtown much lately, and I had an important errand to run. On the way there, I popped into some shops. I've been considering getting a headboard for my bed for years, but haven't found one I like. I'd never really looked around here at Bolia, and it turns out they have a really nice headboard, so I got some fabric samples. Next up was a quick browse at Design Torriet. I also went to Granit, but I didn't get anything in any of the shops. I don't need anything, I just enjoy looking. Then I had my appointment. I'm getting proper glasses. I've been using reading glasses for years, but I feel I really need to get proper glasses and maybe even contact lenses. It was fun trying out different styles, but I settled on my usual tortoise shell in a classic shape. I had another hour before meeting up with my friend Sanna, so I looked around in a few more shops. I went into Arket. I also used the bathroom at the department store Orleans and after that popped in at the shopping shop Systrana Voltaire, the Voltaire sisters. Again, I didn't buy a single thing, but I enjoyed seeing what they have.
Then I went to meet up with Sanna. We have a new favorite place to go. It's the Beirut Cafe at the Museum of Mediterranean and Near Eastern Antiquities. We always get one of the tables on the balcony overlooking the exhibits. We usually go on a weeknight. It's quiet, they serve wine and good food. Highly recommend. After a few hours of chit-chat, I made my way back home in the dark and ended my day with a cat on my lap in my armchair before heading to bed. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, it really helps my channel. If you're looking for sources for things, you might get lucky in the description box. There's a link that takes you to my website where I'm collecting all the links for you. Thanks so much for watching, I'll see you in the next one. Hey då!